Sai Ram. Welcome to Shri Satya Sai Lok Seva online classes. Let's learn English series with Mrs. Kalpana Hablekar. So today we are going to know about clause. Okay. So let us learn what is clause. A clause is a group of words that contains a subject and a verb that has a relationship. Okay. A clause is a group of words that contains a subject and a verb that has a relationship. Okay. It expresses an action or a state of being. A clause can often function as an independent sentence, but this is not always. Clause. A clause is a group of words that contains a subject and a verb that has a relationship. Okay. It expresses an action or a state of being. A clause can often function as an independent sentence, but this is not always. Okay. It can act as an independent, but it is not always. A sentence can have one clause or multiple clause. Okay. A sentence can have one clause or multiple clause. Now different types of clauses. Seven different types of clauses which are classified on the basis of what they denote in a sentence. Now let us see how many types. Seven types. Seven different types of clauses which are classified on a basis of what they denote in a sentence. Independent main clause, the first one. Second, coordinate clause. Third one, relative clause. Fourth one, subordinate clause. Fifth one, the noun clause. Sixth, the adjective clause. And seventh, the adverb clause. Okay. So, see so many are there. Don't have to worry. Once you know what it is, no need of seeing again and again. Okay. But till you know, you keep reading this. Independent main clause, coordinate clause, relative clause, subordinate clause, the noun clause, the adjective clause and the adverb clause. Now, this clause actually the subject, the main um, uh, subject of this, you know, clause is uh, just for your general knowledge, okay. You should not take it very uh, seriously, but you have to know what it is. So, let us do this. Let us play a game on opposite words. Okay. Now, in this lesson, we have seen only the seven types of clause. Okay. Now, coming, we will see what are individually. So, now what is dirty? What is the opposite of dirty? Yes, what is it? Come on, can you guess? Yes, clean. Dirty, clean. Okay. Then we have noisy, N O I S Y, noisy. Okay. There is lot of loud noise coming. And what is this? Yes, quiet, Q U I E T, quiet, Q U I E T, quiet. Most of the children make the spelling mistake, Q U I T E, they write. Okay. But it is not. So it is Q U I E T, quiet. Then we have heavy, H E A V Y, heavy, H E A V Y, heavy, versus, yes, light, L I G H T, light. Now, light means light, which is light in weight, okay, not that light which we switch on and we switch off, okay. Yes, then we have light that is light. Now, this is the bulb okay and this is dark so light and dark we can always say bright and dark also okay so happy h a p p y happy see the smiley yes and sad s a d sad okay s a d sad then we have tall t a 
L L tall, then short S H O R T short S H O R T short. Okay, young Y O U N G young Y O U N G young. See in this they are showing different stages of young, baby, then little big, and then older. So Y O U N G young, and this is. old o l d old okay yes then we will see what is for us in loud reading and handwriting practice thought for the day today okay joy and sorrow profit and loss light and darkness are pairs of opposite in which the absence of one is the sign of its opposite for both the root cause is the brahman all things originate from the brahman only who is the divinity within each of us so brahman is the only divinity which is in each of us says bhagwan shri satya sai baba okay so you read this satya sai baba properly okay and you have to write all s capital and b capital also so let us read again thought for the day joy and sorrow now just now we did opposites right in the last class so joy and sorrow profit and loss profit and loss light and darkness light and darkness are pairs of opposite in which the absence of one is the sign of its opposite that means if light is not there then darkness will come when darkness is not there light will come so sign absence of one is the sign of its opposite for both the root cause is the brahman all things originate from the brahman only who is the divinity within each of us says satya sai baba okay so thank you for watching Shri Satya Sai Lok Seva Gurukulam online classes. Let's learn English series with Mrs. Kalpana Hebleka. Let the light of love and peace be shared with you. Sai Ram. Thank you.